Alright, so in today's video, I'm going to be doing what I would consider one of the craziest bathroom designs ever where I try to do an in-ground tub. First thing I need to do is get my room tool and build me a good size rectangle or square box. Maybe something like that. And most importantly, first to get this build started, I'm going to need to get some lights in here. And I'm definitely going to need some paint and some floors. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep these floors. I'm definitely going to change this. I'm just using this for now until I put my little design together. All right, so to start this design off, I'm going to just go ahead and start off with the tub design. So what I need to do first is build a two square wide rectangle right here. Oh, I can't do this on the second floor. I need to do this on the first floor because I can't push the floor. In. All right, so what I'm about to do is just take this box and move it down to the first floor. All right, boom. So now we can lower this platform twice. I think we need to do it too. If not, it's probably three. Okay, we're just going to do three for now on the building safe side. I'm going to remove this wall right here. And that hole looks a little deep. That look coffin deep. Okay, that just looks a little bit too deep. That look like you can put a casket in there, no lie. But anyways, we're going to get a tub to test Fit and make sure that this hole is not too deep which i'm thinking this is definitely too deep oh yeah that's definitely deep that looks like a coffin okay so let's just pull the tub out there and we're gonna pull this platform up once now let's see if the tub goes in it the right way yep it definitely does now okay now we can try to find the perfect tub for this design i'm not sure which tub i want to use okay maybe we just use that same tub but in a different color like that the next thing i want to do is pull this outside wall in one and just build another wall on this side. And I definitely need shorter walls. I definitely think shorter walls look way better. Now we can get our glass windows and put on each side. Just place one there like that. And remove these walls from the back. Oh, why did it take the window with it? It's not supposed to take. Oh, I think BB.move objects is not on. Let's turn that on. Okay, so now this window should this wall should remove without the window. Boom. And we just gonna repeat that same process on the other side. And I'm not sure if I'm going to keep these windows white. I might change it up. All right. So for the so-called shower area right here, I'm going to just use some white gravel flooring in this area. I feel like that looks real nice in here. And I think it's a way you can put some trimming around the inside of this thing for this tub. Let's see. Let's go here to platform trimming. And I'm going to try this one. Okay. That's that one right there a little bit too thick. Okay. So there's none that will fit in between there the right way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just... Um, all right, guys, so I'm not really sure what kind of trimming I can put in between here. This one right here is a little bit too thick, and then this one right here is too skinny. Oh, we can use the same kind of trimming, but a different color. It's, it fits in there perfectly, so we're going to use that one. All right, you guys, so the next thing I want to do is towel in the inside of the shower. I'm not sure if I want to use this towel on the inside. kind of hate that it has that little baseboard look, but on these outside walls, I want to use this towel right here. I feel like this is a nice little design y'all drop in the comment section let me know do y'all like that or should i use something else and i'm not gonna lie i kind of want to put a window right here i feel like that would be a nice little design so yeah i think i'm gonna put this window here this looks nice next thing i'm gonna do is add some new vanities um since i'm going with the black and white design i'm gonna use these gray and black cabinets i'm trying to decide do i do two of the regular sinks or do i do two sinks with these cabinets and do a bill hack let me just give you guys a little idea of what i'm talking about do i use one of those cabinets in the middle and then two of these on the outsides like that i feel like this is a nice little design maybe i put the toilet in the middle i don't know or maybe i just leave them spread out like that i kind of like the way that looks so i use those and then i'll put a mirror above it uh where's the new mirror and i'll put this mirror above them like that on both sides and then put this towel in the background on each side should i add it in the middle also uh i think i'm gonna put something else in the middle oh maybe i put this in the middle and then set like a dirty clothes hamper or maybe one of these cabinets in the middle Ooh, maybe i set this cabinet in the middle like that oh that's kind of skinny but i don't know um oh i just came up with the perfect idea i can put this marble accent table in the middle like that or i can take this and slide it over not too far where it's like showing on the outside on that side but do it like that and then copy it and put it the same way i got it on that side on this side so it looks like the sinks is in the marble not even a lot that flickering is killing me but i feel like that's a nice little design i'm not sure what we'll put right here y'all drop in the comment section or if y'all want to get this little design on the gallery y'all can and y'all can do whatever y'all want to with it okay but the last thing we need to do is add a toilet i'm not even sure which toilet or how i want to set this up because of the way i got this bathroom set up um maybe we grab 
this taller right here in black and white and i'm going to place it like right here but i'm not sure what to do around it um i'm thinking put some immaculate shelving above it like that and yeah i can't really think of nothing else to do with this right here all right so the last thing we need to do for this is see if that tub is actually functional so let's go into live mode and i'm gonna click on the tub and see if my sims actually come to take a bath and there goes my sim she's actually coming oh will she get in the tub oh she won't get in the tub okay it's not functional is there a reason i mean i feel like this should actually still be functional but it's not i thought it was is the sink still functional since we did this little bill hack and the sinks are not functional either okay okay so this stuff is not actually functional but is definitely a nice design i definitely love the way this bathroom came out let me go in first person this is definitely a nice bathroom design i meant to change the floor color in here to like gray or white or something but i forgot but this bathroom design definitely came together nicely definitely love the way this look y'all drop in the comment section and let me know what y'all think it is and let me know would you do this bathroom design in your house build even though it's not functional or would you just try to figure something else out drop in the comment section and let me know and i'm gonna do more builds like this and i'm gonna catch you guys in the next video Peace.